then we're going to talk about cleanup. Your little plate, you have a damp sponge. And you can do this if you've got a utility sink. Don't put your plate under the water, but if you're at a utility sink, then you can rinse, or a sink where nobody minds if there's a little bit of black ink in it for a little bit. You can just rinse your sponge. Okay, so you can see that the sponge, the dampened sponge, is picking up that ink. And then you can take a paper towel or a rag and you dry it off. So now I can see that I'm back to the plate. All right. And then when it comes to cleanup of your ink area, this I definitely suggest you do buy a sink. Um, if there's extra ink, um, and definitely don't take out more than like a tablespoon of ink, especially when it's hot out, because you're just going to waste your ink. But I can't put that back. And um, you could get some plastic wrap, maybe, and put plastic wrap over it if you were going to continue to do some proofing and see if that preserves it. But if you're done, just go ahead and get a paper towel and wipe up the bigger quantities of the black ink. Same with your palette knife and throw that away and then grab your sponge and what I want you to start out with is the brayer so take that dampened sponge and wipe it across the surface of the brayer it's kind of soothing even when it's warm outside so I'm moving my sponge around and again, it's just damp. It's not sopping wet, but there's enough water on the sponge to help to dissolve that ink that we rolled onto it. And now I'm moving the sponge across and also spinning my little brayer. Set this puppy down and then take the paper towel. And it's going to stain, so, so the inks will somewhat stain the brayer, but it should not be black. All right, It basically will be a little bit grayed, and, and that's perfectly fine. All right, So I probably go back down to a sink, rinse out my sponge, take it across the brayer one more time, and then right away take the paper towel over it, or the rag. If you have a super special rag, you can do it with that as well. This I would take down to the um, sink and I'd rinse off all of this and rinse out my sponges. And so that is it. That is your proofing um, demo, and we'll go over this together. So as always, note some questions that you might have, and we'll go over them together.